Some Apple users are complaining that their iPhone screen freezes randomly. In this video, we will show you how to fix it easily. Method 1. Try for a hard reset. If you want a hard reset iPhone, you need to quick press the volume up button and quick press the volume down. Then hold the power button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. Method 2. Restart the frozen app. Swipe up from the bottom of the screen about a quarter of the way. Swipe up on the app that's frozen to close it. Method 3. Update iOS software. Go to Settings. Click General. Click Software Update. If there is an available update, press the Download and Install button, and enter your passcode to confirm your update. Method 4. Try Joyo Share Alt Fix. The fifth solution is Joyo Share Alt Fix. It is a professional iOS repair tool can fix more than 150 iPhone issues. Not only iPhone, but also iPad, iPod Touch. Firstly, install and launch Joyo Share Alt Fix on the computer. Plug your iPhone to the computer. After that, press the start button to proceed. You are now in the mode selection window. There are two modes available for you. As we just need to fix iPhone iPhone screen freezes issue, it is enough to select the standard mode, which will not cause any data loss, then press the next button. In this menu, there is a guideline how to put iPhone into DFU or recovery mode, and we need to put iPhone into DFU or recovery mode. Some of the info about your iPhone will be displayed on the screen. Make sure all the info is correct and change the wrong parts. Then press the download button to download the matching firmware package. Lastly, click the repair button. The downloaded firmware package will be unzipped, and the program will start to fix your iPhone issue. A few minutes later, the repairing process will finish, and your iPhone will come back to the normal. Method 5. Reset all settings. If restarting iPhone does not work, you can try to reset your iPhone, but this method means resetting your iPhone to factory settings. Before adopting this way, do not forget to back up your data. That's all, hope this video will help you, see you next time.